back with another banger. We're going to be talking about ApeCoin, A-P-E-U-S-D. I'll go ahead and type it out for you guys right here, A-P-E-U-S-D. Now, with ApeCoin, we did have two levels on here. We have one level about $7.70 as a resistance level and a buying level at $7.05. Now, as you can tell, look what price did. When price came down there to that buying pressure level, did you see any buying pressure? No. It started to act as a support. And then price even came back up to it and tested that buying level as a resistance. Now, when a buying level tests as resistance, that is usually bearish. So I am expecting some lower prices. So I'll give you guys all new levels. I'm looking out for 8 point. Make sure you guys smash the like button. Subscribe if you are new. Let's get the channel over 10K subscribers. And follow me on Instagram at will.knowledge. Let's get me over 1,000 followers. Will.knowledge is my only Instagram account. So ApeCoin, I'm going to move this resistance level down. I'll probably post a lot of videos today. I'll try to keep them short, but I'll probably post a lot of videos um, of a different uh, cryptos, okay? So new resistance level is about $7.25 on ApeCoin. It needs to pass that resistance level for me to start wanting it to trade higher. So if it doesn't pass this, it's probably just going to keep falling lower and lower, which is very important. Then this buying level at $7.05 is going to go all the way down to $6.50 now. Okay, so $6.50 is the new buying pressure level that I'm looking out for ApeCoin. But we also have a support level, I would say, at about $6.70. So these are all the new levels that I'm looking for on ApeCoin right now. Uh, I'll about to type in eight. Was it to six? $6.70 as a support. So why these levels are important is because... In between here, if you zone out, um, ApeCoin has that tendency to have a deeper pullback before its next run, okay? So as it runs, it has a deeper pullback, then it runs again. Trade softer, deeper pullback, then it runs again. Trade softer, deeper pullback, then it runs again. Trade softer, getting that deeper pullback, ready for that run again, okay? That's how I'll be looking to play it. And then if you look at these runs, the, that run was about 32%. This run, about 24%. This run, about 22%. So we could be expecting about a 20 to 30% run when that next run does come. So 8 point is showing a little pattern. That's why I have these levels all the way down here. I'm expecting a little deeper pull down. And then, boom, go up to that next leg. Okay. So... That's what I'm really waiting on, ApeCoin. Like I said, now, if it starts to break down and actually break these support levels, break the buying levels, doesn't show any pressure, then we're probably going to see ApeCoin all the way down here to the low 6 even $5 ranges. Be mindful of that. I do want to get a long position on ApeCoin. I just don't know when I want to get that yet because I feel like ApeCoin could go back up to like $20 or so. So I'll probably hold it for a year or two if I need to. But I am looking for that long position. Make sure you guys join the team. It's that first link in the description. But that's the main levels for ApeCoin. Anything changes, I'll update you guys. Always remember, no recommendation to buy or sell anything. This is for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in the video. I'll catch you guys in that next one.